Which I mean, I've already see. waited a long time for the paperback to come out. Hey guys, I'm Samson. And I'm Brody. And welcome, welcome to, to Karen's Gone, Gone Wild. Wild. This is the show that features the best Karen clips from around the internet. We got the memes, we got the breakdowns to give you a closer look on who these Karens really are. That's right, and we have the classic Karen clip of the week. The KKK? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now this first Karen is dubbed the Bagel Karen. She's gonna make me hate bagels? I hope not, Brody, because I'm Jewish and I love me some bagels. Check out the clip. Is something gonna happen? Yeah. Wait for it, Brody. Please leave. Why? Because he's a bitch ass. Yeah, oh, wow, wow, wow. Yeah, that is, um, that's textbook Karen right Classic there. Classic Karen right hello, there. Hello, Didn't hello, take her long hello. to act like that. Excuse me, ma'am. Hello, ma'am. You need to go. I said it. You heard it. And she said it. She said it in a combo. You know, that's in the hood. You get knocked out for saying that. That's right, Brody. I wish somebody would have knocked her out. What's surprising is like all these mixed babies. Like she's the only white woman in New York that's a baby walker. That's right, man. She's like a racist Angelina Jolie. <laughs> Apparently, Brody, this Karen has hurt others out in the wild. In the wild, can they tranquilize her or put her down? Because she's a threat to society. She could give somebody cabies. That's right, that's Karen rabies. And that's why, Brody, our show is here to stop one Karen at a time. Well, Brody, let's move on because we could sit on this Karen all day. Or sit with an H. <laughs> now, before Karens, there was a little known thing called Becky. Ah, yes, Barbecue Becky, the originator of all things Karen. That's right, Darwin once said that the evolution of Karen was Becky, Allison, and then Karen, and Allison crawled to Karen. Yeah, in this situation, Barbecue Becky called so Karen could walk. Now, Brody, let's check out this classic Karen clip of the week. Woo! Woohoo! With Barbecue Becky. It's a good time to talk about Barbecue Becky with things opening back up. Yeah. You know, people are going to be grilling a lot more, and this is going to give you an advice on what not to do at that summer cookout. Let's roll the clip. Uh, it's illegal to have a charcoal grill in the park here. No, it's not, actually. I just yeah, looked at the it map. Is. It says this is a designated barbecue area. No, it, if you, it, not for a charcoal grill. So refresh everyone's memory, she came to the cookout uninvited, unannounced as a self-proclaimed charcoal police. You can't just roll in the place and say, hey, I'm the charcoal police. That's right. Let's respect charcoal police here, Karen. That's another thing Karens do, Brody, is they just have zero respect for authority or charcoal police. Or potato salad. Leave the raisins out! Ugh. Even I know that. She looks like Rosie O'Donnell if she joined the Proud Boys. <laughs> <laughs> she looked like Steven Seagal if he fell off. And why are you so bent out of shape over them being Because it... Ah, Brody, now here, we're about to see a very famous Karen tactic where they act like they care about the children, but they really don't. Check it out. The money from our city to do things when children get injured because of improperly disposed. So are you saying that they're going to hurt children out here? Or I mean, like, what, what is it? Chuckle boys, chuckle boys, what you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? It's not allowed. It's illegal to have charcoal in this part of the park. See, here she goes. Karen's always love to break down the laws and everything. You would think more Karen's would go off and be lawyers. She looked like she passed the Hershey bar. <laughs> All right, Brody, now here is the classic Karen moment where she calls the police and acts terrified for her life when there's really nothing happening. Check it out. No, I'm not. I want to be in the following me. Maybe, Brody, it's time to open up the School of Karen Acting Training, or better known as SCAT, because uh, these Karens can't act for shit. I'd give her a waste of SAG award. <laughs> Follow these tips and get invited to the next BBQ. Might score yourself some BBC. <laughs> Not the network, ladies. All right, guys, well, that's it for Karen's, Karen's Gone, Gone Wild. Wild. So submit your Karen clips and memes to us, and we'll feature them right here on this show. Yeah, because if nobody's Karen, this world will actually be a better place. What kind of cockadoody bookstore is this that you don't even know Paul Sheldon? <laughs>